My name is Raymond Zomers and I'm work in the kitchen almost 20 years. Um, also, I have a restaurant in Trussel where I am the chef and the owner. Let's talk about the knowledge and technical skills. So I work uh, 20 years in the kitchen and the seven years uh, it's opened the restaurant. So I have two parts of, of my life. Uh, the very important part is uh, connection with the school and connection also with the students. So because uh, it's uh, very important uh, the first step you go in the school and after that combine uh, the practical uh, with the chefs who works in the kitchen. So uh, of course in the school we know what are the tomatoes but when you get, came in the kitchen you should uh, <laughs> make some uh, food with the tomatoes. So it's not the same but uh, very very important so that's why we work uh, a lot with the Latvian students uh, it's very important part so and uh, also with the students who came from actually from Spain from the Italy from Scandinavian it's uh, also very important because uh, everybody should speak in English so it's uh, also must uh, must Im important part in the, our kitchen and myself also yeah like that. How we judge access for the uh, students? So the first day it's a very important day actually because the students come here walking around and uh, talk to with, uh, the chefs with the me or the waiters and then uh, we judge <laughs> each other what's happening. After that is the second day so when the students uh, taking the arms, the knives and the forks and uh, the spoon and something to do in the kitchen. Um, day by day, approximately one week work uh, with the team and then we know what the level is the each student and then we combine uh, uh, where is the, the students goes. For example, we have the catering uh, kitchen in the downstairs, so we have also the kitchen for the restaurants in upstairs and uh, the prep kitchen and uh, also the restaurant where is uh, going the service. So it's very important part after the one week where we separate uh, the students uh, for the level that goes down and maybe the level is uh, much more higher. For example, it's work uh, almost four years in the school. It's traveling a lot uh, for the, another restaurant. So there is um, really big uh, baggage with the experience and then we uh, put the students on the uh, mission plus and after that in the service so it's uh, then we make the judge and uh, put in the level technical and uh, practical so skills so it's uh, of course two types of them it's a very important part the first one is of course at the school you learn uh, the theoretical so everybody should know what is the quality cucumbers what's the knives uh, how we cut it, how we boil it, uh, how many degrees you, should, you need for the medium steak, for the rare steak, and like that. So after that, the students go in the kitchen, also in the school, and uh, the, probably the best is they're in the kitchen, where is the practical. So then the students uh, have a experience and have a knowledge about the ingredients and then go there in the kitchen uh, make some preparations uh, where he or she knows uh, what's needed the temperature for, for example for the oven for the blender and okay, then it goes in the kitchen and uh, there is a practical and uh, the students knows theoretical everything and then combine um, it's there is also really intent in interesting part of them because uh, for example the students who came from another countries there is another uh, culture um, ingredients uh, another uh, mind so we also learn with the students uh, when we work together in the kitchen uh, for example, how we, we made uh, some desserts or some uh, creme brulee, for example, uh, because there is a lot of types how it's possible to make it. 
So it's also very important for the, our chefs who work in the kitchen many years, but there is a new young students games for us and uh, learn also me how we make uh, creme brulee, for example, uh, 82 degrees. It's uh, the flavors, it's much more better, for example, uh, perhaps uh, than, than, than what we made uh, 200 degrees in the water bottle. The question is open at uh, how can we combine with the uh, students, with the, the teacher and the, the chefs, the more excited the relationship. And then my answer is the first one, um, when the chefs who work in the kitchen many years uh, stop this uh, experience with the restaurants and uh, the kitchen, so go to the school and learn this young people uh, with new experience, uh, new passions. It's um, my parents, uh, my experience with the uh, Italian chefs who is uh, always be like that. So work in the school, uh, really all the men who is uh, work in the kitchen perhaps 40 years. So it's very, the first step one. The second one is uh, for the first day, okay, not the first day, but for the first months you go in the school, learn about uh, the tomatoes and cucumbers and like that. And after that, you should go in the kitchen. Not after two years, after three years, but you should go the, after one month with the uh, work with the chefs. So it's a very important part because um, maybe some of them uh, after two or three years uh, when it's starting work in the kitchen, it's uh, really um, careful. <laughs> maybe it's uh, not this professional actually for this young people. So